Marty Morningweg had his work cut out for him last week. He took over for Mark Trestman as the offensive coordinator, and that meant he had to put in long hours with late nights to get ready for his first game as the Ravens play caller. And Marty admitted today that he wasn't getting much sleep in his first week as the OC. I went through uh, almost a whole bottle, I went a whole bottle of the, the vi Visine, you know? So I didn't even have time to think about that. And, and uh, you know, all of our focus as coaches were, get, uh, you know, getting those players ready to play. And then, and then it was about, what, Friday night, Saturday morning, I said, you know, hey, in fact, I told them, we got to have ourselves ready too, because it was a long, long week last week. <laughs> now the first game with Marty calling the plays kind of produced mixed results. The Ravens put up 23 points and Joe Flacco threw for more than 300 yards. But the offense also kept shooting itself in the foot with penalties. The Ravens got flagged for holding, false starts, illegal procedure, and delay of game. And that made it tough to march down the field and put up points. Now Morningwake talked about the need to clean up those miscues. It felt like we, we were just a little scattered, you know? And so we've got to tighten that thing up and we've got to play with consistency. And, and, and so I'm talking about you know, the penalties, we've got to clean that thing up. And if you're looking to get a break from all this talk about penalties and getting more out of the offense, well, I've got the perfect distraction for you. You need to check out the latest episode of the Lounge Podcast where Ryan Mick and I sat down with offensive lineman John Urschel for a really interesting conversation about his work in mathematics and playing football despite the risk of head injuries. I mean, John's even working on artificial intelligence and teaching computers how to learn. I'm telling you, you got to check it out. You can download it wherever you get your podcast. It's up there now. So go ahead, do that. That's it for me on the final drive today. But as always, thanks for watching, and I'll catch all of you again tomorrow.